Hello. Gonna go ahead and apologize for the bad uh, camera quality because I was planning on doing this on my phone, uh, but I only have 20%, so <laughs> the laptop it is. Um, I am so late on the game whenever it comes to this video. I'm sorry, <laughs> life has been really crazy, and you know, uh, those seven to eight weeks in my pregnancy in the first trimester, um, it was really, it was really hard for me. Um, I was not blessed with the easy first trimester with no sickness. I was very blessed with very bad sickness, and sometimes it still gets bad, um, but for the most part, it's better, and I'm happy, so hey, Cheyenne. Um, so today is a video that I've been very, very excited for. I always get very excited about this because this is me sniffing and talking about all of the new releases with our catalog. So our fall winter catalog is officially live and I am so excited for this catalog. We have done so much growth with this catalog that it's it's just unbelievable i mean we have a whole new disney line i mean a video all about disney is coming very soon too because now that i feel better um i, I have so many videos planned and i love doing videos i love um i love editing videos i love doing live videos because i get to chat with y'all so i just love being able to share all of this with you guys um so today since i talk so much about every single cent. <laughs> this one is only about the brand, brand new releases, not including Disney, because Disney is gonna have its own video. So, you were waiting on this live. <laughs> I've been waiting on this live. It's just, live is just, you know, it's, it's just so crazy. Um, but I'm back on my A game, I promise. I'm back, I'm here. <laughs> I'm back to um, scheduling out my YouTube videos and everything like that. So, I'm, just, I'm so stoked for fall and all these scents and all these products and all these warmers and the scents you go solid. Like I'm so, so excited for it. So um, we have four, 15 brand new releases uh, for the fall and winter catalog. And then we have one brand new release uh, for the kids collection. So I'm gonna go ahead and talk about that one too because I love it. Um, and I can't live without it. Um, <laughs> so these are all scents that are absolutely brand spanking new. So these are scents that have not been around ever, like ever. Um, we do every single catalog. We have obviously like the spring and summer since we're tired and then all the fall and winter scents come back. But um, it's only certain scents that come back. So like every year, like we have scents from like previous years for fall and winter. You know, like they are returning and then these are new. So let's go ahead and get on in because I am just so excited. Um, I love them. Um, first, I'm going to say the scent trend um, for this catalog. It says these fragrances contain woods, our current scent trend fragrance family. So woods, I'm very excited about that because it's not just all pumpkin. You know, like what's, what's the typical fall fragrance? Pumpkin and apple. So I'm just, these are different. Like I like it. Like this is new and this is innovative and I can't wait. So the first one, I'm going to go alphabetical order. Uh, the first one is what I warmed at my open house. This one won my vote by, um, or my poll by one vote. This is apple cherry strudel. Um, it, the scent description says, Granny Smith cherry and vanilla drizzle insist on dessert first. And I already know I love this. This isn't a first sniff video because I just, I've already smelled all these. <laughs> but this is, this is like a, a sniff and chat video. Apple cherry strudel. If you love apple, if you love bakery scents, if you love bakery apple scents, apple cherry strudel is amazing. Let me get his dinner out of the oven. <laughs> Sorry guys, I got the door shut so I can't hear the, the uh, dinging going off. Um, but this is apple cherry strudel. It is absolutely, it's, it's perfect. We really don't have that many cherry um, scents. 
So it makes me really happy to see it, especially in a, um, a bakery scent because bakery scents are my absolute favorite scents. I feel like if this, if you like like blueberry cheesecake in or apple butter frosting in your car as a car bar, this isn't available as a car bar, but you can get it as a scent circle, um, which is only $3. It lasts for about a week or two. And I mean, it's a car scent, you know, like you can hang it up. It just doesn't last as long as the car bars do, but this would be an awesome scent if you love bakery scents, period. Um, it's very, it's very strudely. Does that make sense? Like I smell this. Like I feel like I just walked up to Panera's bakery. Um, you know how like in Panera they have like the whole bakery and then they have like the place where you actually get like your food food, like your uh, pasta and sandwiches and stuff. I feel like I just stepped up to the bakery. Like this is just, this smells exactly like the cherry pastries that I love to get um, at work every morning because ugh, they're so good. I love it. It's very it's very authentic. Like it just smells like you are baking a cherry cobbler, which I love. Um, the performance is awesome. I warmed it already because I, um, since this one won, I warmed it at my open house. It lasted for days. It was very, very strong. So this is apple cherry strudel, and this is the first one in the new releases. And it gets a big A plus from me because I love a bakery scent. And then I got these. The next one is Autumn Hearth. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, it's Autumn Hearth. It says, cue up a classic. A Apple, cinnamon, and tonka are all about fall. So this, it kind of reminds me of Amber Hollow. But Amber Hollow doesn't have cinnamon in it, um, to my knowledge, or apple, really. I don't think so. Cannot remember. Um, it does remind me a lot of Amber Hollow. But this, I do I, I smell an apple in it, so I'm very happy about this. This is Team Apple to me. It is like an apple cinnamon scent, and it does have that that really classic kind of fall. You just walked into Walmart or Target, and you're walking down the aisles of all the fall decorations. Does that make sense? Do you know what I'm saying? Because I know you do. That's exactly what this smells like to me. This smells very, very classic. I'm very happy that this... Um, this was Cincy now, so this one kind of reminds me of, where is it at? It reminds me of Autumn Sunset. Autumn Sunset is apples, pumpkins, and leaves and spices. So this one reminds me of Autumn Sunset, but I believe, in my personal opinion, this one has more cinnamon to me, to me. So Autumn Hearth is a great fall classic, and it gets a very, very big A plus for me. Um, Thank you guys. Uh, the next on the lease is the first uh, fall fragrance that I smelled at Cincy Family Reunion, and that is Blueberry Pancakes. So this one I'm very, very excited for because I get asked a lot if we have maple fragrances. So this is Blueberry Pancakes. Um, it is Blueberry and Butter Accord over Light Maple Make the Mood. Blueberry and Butter Accord over Light Maple Make the Mood. That's the same description. I love it. I honestly, I don't eat maple syrup. I will. I eat. You left the pups in here. <laughs> I do not eat maple syrup. I can't stand it. I cannot stand the flavor. I cannot stand the sticky, stickiness of it. But I love the smell of it. Like I love the smell of you know pancakes with um, maple on. Just like I love the smell of French toast, but I don't like French toast. <laughs> um, I. Love the smell of maple, even though I don't eat it. So I'm very excited that now I get a maple fragrance friend that I can enjoy um, on a daily basis. So I have not worn this yet because um, it did sell at my open house. And I'm still waiting on my um, first fall order to come in since we have the new catalog and Labor Day. Uh, this week's uh, shipping has been a little bit slower. But this is Blueberry Pancakes. It's a bakery scent in my opinion. <laughs> I know pancakes aren't like bakery, but this is the food scent in my opinion, and I absolutely love this blueberry pancake. So big A plus for that. Uh, the next one is Breakfast Blend. So it says get buzzed on pure scent of rich just brewed coffee. So this one is more authentic coffee grounds than mocha doodle. This is like legit. You just open up a bag of coffee. And this, that's what this is. Mocha Doodle has, let me find it. Mocha Doodle 
is pretty much the same thing, but it's also different. Um, see, mocha doodle has sugar and caramel and heavy cream in it. It's a little bit more sweeter, kind of like maybe like you know a latte or something kind of like that. You know, like a lot of I put a lot of sugar and creamer and stuff like that in my coffees. Um, but this is like you just open a bag of coffee uh, coffee beans or coffee grounds, whatever, and that's what this smells like. So. I think this is very different. I think that this is, I'm really excited to see how this one performs. Um, I do love the smell of coffee, just like I love the smell or I love the taste of coffee. So this is, this is strict coffee. Like a good coffee. Like it smells very good. Uh, let's see. I'm trying not to talk too much because I talk, I talk a lot, guys. Um, the next one is Christmas, Christmas Cactus. This is very unique. Um, this is one I was not expecting. It says, a gave, a gave, a gave nectar and citrus trim Siberian fur for a new kind of winter wonderland. So this one, like, I mean, it's just not your typical Christmas scene. Like, this is innovative. Like, I love this. It's, it's fresh. It's, it's a very fresh kind of Christmas it's not fruity. It's not, you know, like cranberry or um, mistletoe or anything like that. Like, it's just a very, very fresh, very fresh fall, winter fragrance. It does have citrus in it. So that's one thing I do love. I cannot wait to warm this. It, it's very green. Does that make sense? Like, it smells very green. Very, very, very nice. So this is Christmas Cactus, and it's a good one. It's a very, very good one. And then we have one that I absolutely love. Where do you go? This one is called Cozy Cardigan, like cardigan that you wear. This is Cozy Cardigan, and it says, Find a bedded bliss in layers of soft suede, blushing rose, and amber silk. This is one that I had no idea that I was going to love so much. It's so, it's not like your typical bakery Christmas fragrance. Like, this is very... It reminds me a little bit of business casual. I don't know why. Like I feel like all the scents like this kind of remind me of like business casual or um, pristine waters for some reason. I don't know why, but it's like the soft suede and the silk. It's just very nice. It's not bakery. It's not citrusy. It's not uh, fruity in any kind of way. It's a scent that it's a scent that I think that you just need to smell and you need to try. I think this would be amazing as a scent circle in your car. I think men would love this too. I think guys would absolutely love this cozy cardigan. Uh, I'm very, very impressed with this. This is just one that I had no idea that I was going to love so much. So big A plus for me. And the next is farmhouse fur. So this one says fur needle and cedarwood get some pink grapefruit pizzazz. Fur needle, cedarwood, and pink grapefruit. So this one, it's a little bit more, it's more green than the Christmas cactus, if that makes sense. Christmas cactus is very, very, I feel like the citrus and Christmas cactus, yeah. I feel like Christmas cactus is just more fresh to me, but farm, farmhouse fur is, it's very, it's, it's very woodsy. Uh, it's that fur needle and that cedar wood. So it's very, very woodsy in my opinion. I think it reminds me, oh, it reminds me a lot of maybe very snowy spruce for some reason. Yeah, that's what I want to say. It does remind, remind me a lot of very snowy spruce. So it's, it's a nice one if you like those kind of like, you know, unique, not typical winter fragrances. I think that you would really like farmhouse fur. This one is a very nice one. I think this is going to be one of the scents that um, I think that anybody can enjoy. Does that make sense? I feel like it's just one of those. And then the next one is Grandma's Grandma's Orchid. Orchard. Sorry. <laughs> Grandma's Orchard. I'm very tired. Um, so obviously this is the apple scent. Uh, it says discover total tranquility in fresh apple wood and Andrew pear. This is very fruity. This is very apple pear fruity. So I like this one a lot. I think this is absolutely perfect for now. Um, there was one, I think last year or the year before, call it crisp, crisp apple air or 
crisp apple orchard, uh, something like that. So I think this is just kind of like an upgraded version of that. Uh, I love it. Definitely, if you like apple scents, you are going to love this grandma's orchard. It's very, very nice. Very, very nice. Hello, everybody. Let's talk all these new scents. And then I'll obviously have this video posted up if you missed it or if you um, need to watch some of the first ones. Uh, we're about halfway through now. I'm doing good at on time, not talking 10 minutes about every scent. <laughs> uh, the next one is a lavender cotton. Lavender cotton. It says, find your magical moment in purple lavender, soft cotton, and daisy blossom. This is a very nice... It's a very nice clean scent. Um, it does remind me a lot of French lavender, but French lavender is more strictly lavender. Yeah, it's more strictly lavender. This is a little bit softer than uh, French lavender, I think. I love the cotton part it put on it. Like, I feel like this would be an amazing scent for your laundry. <laughs> like I feel like that's what the kind of scent it's reminding me of. To me, in my personal opinion, it kind of reminds me of a lavender version of coconut cotton and if you have been around or if you've known Cincy for a while you know that coconut cotton was very it's very missed it's very very missed um I loved coconut cotton it did retire it has not come back but this is lavender cotton and it's, it's very nice it reminds me of some dryer sheets like really really good dryer sheets like I, it's it's very clean I feel like it so if you like lavender if you like clean kind of scents like this, I think that you would absolutely love this. I think this one's going to be a really, really big um, seller for this new catalog. Uh, the next one is something that I haven't heard that many good things about. Not like the performance wise, but people just aren't liking this. Like other Cincy consultants. Uh, this one is Palo Santo, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. It says Palo Santo wood, charred cedar bark, and teak are the ultimate dream boat dream boat blend. I like this. I can't open it. <laughs> I, to me, in my opinion, like it reminds me of some of the men's fragrances from Bath and Body. Like I think it's a men's scent. Like I could imagine. I mean, I'm gonna warm this. Like I think this would be nice. I think this would be nice as a scent circle in your car. It's it's a masculine scent to me. I don't know what it is about it that people just aren't really liking but I mean I'm speaking the honest truth if I mean you know me if I do not like a scent or if I think something smells awful I'm going to tell you <laughs> um I do like a lot like a big range of scents um just because as long as the scent smells like a, like what the scent description smells like or what the scent description says I mean as long as it smells exactly what it's said to smell like, like I think it's a good scent. That doesn't mean that I love every scent. I mean, that just means like I'm happy with the fragrance, even though like lavender cotton is not something that I would personally choose to warm in my car or like buy a room spray of because it's just not my typical kind of scent. Like this one, I kind of want to, I want to try it out. Like I want to warm it. I want to see. I have the hiccups. <laughs> um, so this is Palo Santo. Um, this is a masculine fragrance in my opinion. Um, I, your nose might be completely um, different than mine. So not really sure. Maybe it's just one that you need to smell. But I think that if you like kind of masculine scents, I think you'll like it. So the next one is Perfect Peppermint. Talking about how like I think scents are, the scents that smell like what they're supposed to smell like are very good fragrances. But there, that does not mean that every scent in this catalog is my favorite. I would not lie to you. I cannot stand citrus rosemary <laughs> or pumpkin marshmallow from the last fall and winter catalog. I cannot stand it. It smelled like vomit to me, in my personal opinion. Um, this is perfect peppermint. I'm not a peppermint fan. I think it smells like a great peppermint. It says, cooler than most, pure, pure peppermint is the popular kid you'll love to love. I, I feel this is a very nice, typical peppermint, like candy cane fragrance. But whenever it comes to picking scents for my home and my warmers, I'm not a peppermint person. If you like peppermint, I think you would love this. Um, I don't think we have. I think this was the only peppermint. 
what was the other ones last year? There was two peppermint scents last year. One was like peppermint candy, and one was like the chocolate peppermint patty things. But those did not come back. So this, I'm very happy about this. Um, it does remind me of a more peppermint version of vanilla mint. I absolutely love vanilla mint. I did not think I would. I was not prepared to love it, but I do. So, I mean, you never know. Maybe if I could warm this perfectly pe perfect peppermint, and maybe I could, warm, like, I could like it. But I think it's a very nice peppermint. Brandon loves peppermint scents, like flavor, like fragrances. Like, he loves peppermint. So, I think he would like this one. I don't know if he smelled this one. But that is perfect peppermint. And then we have porch pumpkin. So this is another pumpkin scent. I am team pumpkin and team apple. I cannot pick one. <laughs> this is porch pumpkin, and it says, take the top step with fresh picked pumpkin, acorn, and autumn air. It's just a not, it's just a great pumpkin scent. It's so different. It's not, there's no cinnamon in this, like pumpkin cinnamon swirl. It's not a bakery pumpkin, like pumpkin roll. Um, Farm sand pumpkin. It's, farm sand pumpkin has apple and caramel in it, but porch pumpkin is just fresh picked pumpkin, acorn, and autumn air. I love it. So all three or four, all four pumpkin, like actual pumpkin scents in this catalog, they're all different. They're all they're all very unique, and you might like one and not like the other. Just your nose's opinion. This is porch pumpkin, and I love it because I love everything pumpkin, just not flavor. <laughs> Oh, you're warming a cider meal? Yay, I'm so happy. You love it. I'm so excited for the cider meal car bar because it has pumpkin in it, and I love pumpkin. I'm so happy. I love cider meal. Cider meal, I love cider meal a lot more than I do cedar cider. Yeah, I do like cedar cider, but cider meal, swirl the wind, it's one of my top ones. Uh, but this is porch pumpkin. And now we only have three left. I'm sure y'all are done listening to me talk about all these things and have the attention span of a squirrel like I always do. <laughs> this one is unique and different. This is red cedar and sage. It says run free through red cedar, sage, and fresh forest greens. So like the farmhouse fur and the uh, Christmas cactus, this is not... Puppies, stop playing. This is not... Your typical like Christmas bakery cinnamon latte scent. Um, this is very fresh. If you like woozy scents, if you like honeymoon hideaway, you would love this. Um, if you like the outdoorsy kind of fresh scents, kind of like when you're warming it, it's just going to be like a clean um, kind of burst of fragrance. I think that you will absolutely love this. Um, puppy, stop growling. Oh, I'm being loud. Um, so this is red cedar and sage. I like this. I think it's very unique. I'm very happy with it. And it's a new release. Uh, I got two more. Uh, next one is Snow Place Like Home. It says stay in and chill out with cool mint and a quart of fresh air. Stop. Y'all are being rude. Y'all are interrupting me. I have children already, and my baby isn't even born yet. <laughs> this is Snow Place Like Home. It says, stay in and chill out with cool mint and fresh air. So this is just, this is a very, ever, oh, Misty told me that this smells like toothpaste to her, and ever since then, I think of toothpaste. But it's like a good toothpaste. <laughs> it's a very minty, fresh fragrance. It's not peppermint, and by any means, it's not peppermint. Um. But I think this is one, I don't know why, but it reminds me a little bit of Glacial Ice from the last Fall and Winter catalog. So this is Snow Place Like Home. And I think this one will be a really nice one for the people who love their house to smell really fresh and clean. Uh, I like it. So that is it. And then we have one more, which is one of my absolute favorite ones. I have, ha I have heard so many good things about this, the performance of this scent. Uh, this is winterberry apple tea. It says winter tea cozies up to cranberry, apple, and honey. So I, I already love this. What does this remind me of? It reminds me a little bit of honey pear cider. Uh, honey pear cider has been around for a while. But honey pear cider does not have cranberry in it. No. It's actually completely different. But that's just what it reminds me of. 
This is winter tea, cranberry, apple, and honey. I love it. This is winterberry apple tea. <clears throat> Misty, you bought this from my um, open house uh, last weekend or the weekend before, and she has been messaging me in awe about the performance of this wax. Like she said, it lasted for days, and it was like a strong kind of last. So I am so excited to warm this. I am – it's – you just have to smell it. <laughs> if you love cranberry, you'll love this. But winter tea, cranberry, apple, and honey. This is winter berry apple tea. And it's one of my absolute favorites. I would have to say apple cherry strudel, winter berry apple tea, porch pumpkin. Uh, this is hard. Cozy cardigan. Autumn hearth blueberry pancakes. I might pull all of these. Grandma's Orchard. These are these would all be my favorites. My absolute favorites, just having to pick, sit down right here and just pick them right now would be the winterberry apple tea, blueberry pancakes, grandma's orchard, autumn hearth, apple cherry strudel, cozy cardigan, and porch pumpkin. That's all my personal opinion. So if you tend to like scents that I like, then that is my, that's what I'm gonna recommend to you. And then Last but not least, we have the brand new uh, Scentsy fragrance for our kids collection. It is, I think it deserves to be talked about. This is Berry Fairy Tale, Berry Fairy Tale. And it says, sweet dreams are made of pineapple slices, star apple, and raspberry. And I must talk about this because it reminds me of Rock and Ruby Raz. Sam, you like blueberry pancakes? <laughs> Trying to lock these comments as I go. This is not, I mean, nothing will ever replace Rock and Ruby Raz ever, but this is a very close contender in my personal opinion. It's pineapple slices, star apple, and raspberry. Very, very fruity. I have worn this. I do love this. It's in the kids' collection, but that does not mean nothing. You can still pair it up with any um, six pack of bars that you want, and I'm very, very happy about this one. So if you like the fruity kind of fragrances, you're going to love Fairy Fairy Tale. And that is it, guys. I hope you like that. I'm so excited for the brand new catalog. If you would like a hard copy of the brand new catalog, please just let me know. I can either get one to you for a local, or I can mail you one, or I can always just send you my website, or I can send you the PDF file of this catalog so you can look through the actual catalog page by page. But I do have plenty. If you would like one mailed, um, I do not mind doing that at all. Um, if you are watching this on my YouTube, cha yeah, YouTube channel, if you are a customer and you would like a catalog, please just you know comment below and let me know. Um, I am so excited about this catalog. And I am, I think I'm done. I'm, I'm done chatting. So thank you all for watching. And thank you all. <laughs> thank you all for commenting. And thank you all for watching the replay if you do. Chastin says the kids collection offends me because honestly I can warm candy crave forever. <laughs> I love candy crave. I just ordered the candy crave body wash. So you should try the candy crave body wash. I'm very, very excited about that. Uh, the body wash, what is all this? In? The body wash is available now in, um, where's it at? Amazon Rain, Blue Grotto, Go Go Mango, um, and the where's the kids one in candy crave oodles of orange and jamie tom oh i love it so i ordered myself the candy crave body wash because i absolutely love the body wash it's only eight dollars girl i'm placing an order on sunday you know my orders always go in on sunday or actually i do have your tote back there if um you're free tomorrow or friday i can meet that meet up with you and get you that or if you want to swing by i have it all ready for you um packed and ready to go with goodies inside so just let me know and that's it guys I'm gonna stop rambling now because I know I talk a uh, hundred miles a minute <laughs> it happens it's okay <laughs> bye guys